Huzzah's little battleborn here. Welcome back to Batman Arkham Origins Cold Cold Hard DLC. We're in the final rounds. We're gonna actually do the final contempt you know, final final contestants. The truth of what is going on. Data analysis indicates that he died from heat stroke, but the control room doesn't show signs of overheating. This is some kind of crystallized chemical residue. Traces lead back into the lab. That guy's dead. Oh, there we go. What's this? Uh, what do I? Okay. What am I looking for? Okay. Oh. The trail ends here. I should scan for more evidence. All right. All right. Two men struggled. One of them ran out of the lab. That would be the dead security guard I found. Yep. These palm prints are a match for Victor Freeze. He must have watched the security guard die. Ah. Okay, okay. Scanning, scanning. He scavenged what he needed from various prototypes to build himself a super cooled survival suit. Oh. Ooh, what was over here? Extreme pressure built up inside the tank when ice sealed these outtakes. Oh, jeez. It appears that this guard was frozen by the cryo vapors from the resulting explosion. Oh, that's horrifying. And judging by the guy? The evidence suggests the guard was frozen before the tank ruptured, perhaps by Freeze's cryo cannon. These DNA traces are a match for Victor Freeze. Spatter analysis suggests a blunt impact. Someone assaulted Freeze with a weapon. Jesus. The cannon was knocked over and fired. When the tank exploded, it released a plume of cryochemicals. The plume enveloped Freeze and the guard, but the shockwave knocked the assailant clear. I need to find that weapon. It may have evidence I can use to identify the assailant. All right, let's rewind all the way back in time. There it, there it is. DNA analysis confirms the gun was used to bludgeon Victor Freeze, and fingerprint analysis shows Ferris Boyle. It was Ferris. Oh, uh huh, uh huh. Uh huh. Something was wheeled through this fluid, possibly a gurney. Uh huh. The oh, I must have frozen almost immediately for these tracks to have been preserved. There we go. What's this? Oh, final truth. Odd. Freeze was secretly doing research on Huntington's Korea, but this is a cryogenic weapons lab. The test subject was Nora Freeze. Now I know what happened here. Boyle hired Victor to help advance the secret cryo weapons program within Gothcorp. 
In exchange, Boyle agreed to devote Goth Corp resources to finding a cure for Nora's Huntington's. But Boyle was more interested in how Victor had managed to put Nora into cryostasis. When Victor realized that Boyle had no intention of following through on their deal, oh, he no. to the Huntington's research himself. But Boyle didn't like that. The cryochemical cocktail altered Victor's metabolism, as well as the guards. Boyle escaped ahead of the bloom and had the lab quarantined. Victor survived, but he knew that leaving the supercooled lab would kill him. So he built himself a suit and utilized an organic supercoolant to keep his core temperature sub-zero. All this violence. He's just trying to save his dying wife. The supercoolant Victor uses in his suit is the same fluid I need for the cryo drill. And now we know the truth. We know who, the real story. Alfred, send Gordon the evidence I've gathered on Boyle's crimes. I'm sorry, Master Bruce. I know you had high hopes for what Ferris could do for Gotham. That doesn't matter now. Victor's plan was never to kill Boyle. He needs Boyle's security access to get his wife out of Goth Corp. That's all he wants. And now, you're going to stop him? I have to. And are you still going to need that gurney? I am. But not for Victor. He has changed his heart. You know what I'm gonna do when I get out of here? I'm gonna have candy for me a nice hot bath. And then I'm gonna drown you in it. Uh, I'm trying, boss. This ice is tough. Oh, you completely and utterly dead Get over here, you nasty bugger. I just wanna listen to him. <coughs> so I can strangle some sense into you. Boss, you gotta calm down. We'll get you out of there. Somehow. Why are you waiting for? Break his Yeah. How you doing, Penguin? You you gonna get me on this damn iceberg? You're good right where you are. But but you can't leave me here. I'll freeze to death. Not my problem. Oh, so you come back to gloat, have you? Oh, I'll hang you with that bloody cape. You hear me? Yeah, this is the part where I say, I caught ya! Listen, Penguin, you are my favorite villain of all time. Second to... Oh, you uh, can't leave me here, Batman. I'm freezing to death. Don't worry, Mr. Penguin. I'll thaw you out and you can do whatever you want. For now, I'm going to actually free this guy. Because we're in the final battles, boys. Oh, God, it's bastard. You know that? Yeah, I know. Thanks. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, let me just double check something here. Do I need to pay attention to anything up here at all? Yeah, whatever, I don't care. All right, nothing. Join me in my face. Free. 
see if I need any. You don't have the guts to do it. Keep stalling and the cold will do it for me. Uh, let me say, Mr. Freeze is badass. Penguin's my favorite, but Mr. Freeze is badass. Victor, you have to let him go. I'm taking my wife. You can't stop me. I know the truth, and so will the police. Boyle will face judgment for his crimes. It, it was an accident. You don't know what you're talking about. What? Nothing matters. Do you understand? Nothing but my Nora. Oh boy. You've endangered lives all over this city. Nora would never have wanted this. No. Oh. What she wants is to live a long life in the warmth of the sun. A hand in mine. But because of him, she'll only feel the icy touch of a man whose emotions run as cold as the blood in his veins. Where are the rest of you? Get in here and honor our bargain. All right, I have no idea how this plays. Sir, you can overload those cryogenerators using your thermal gloves. Look for the control panels. If Boyle had honored our bargain, none of this violence would have been necessary. He's right there. Ah, uh, break the ice! Break the ice! Ah, oh, break! Ah! All right. So where is this? Cr All right. Let's see. Uh. So what do I do? Do I have a time limit? Do you have any idea what Boyle was doing to her? I can guess. Oh, there we go. He's escaped. Alright, so... Let's see. He's up there. There is no need for this Batman. Of course not, Victor. But you're still doing it. Do you understand what it's like to have someone taken from you? Sir, you need to find the control panels for those cryogenerators and disable them. Well, allow me to figure out what I'm doing first. Let's see, he's over there. Don't allow my wife to be subjected to any more tests. Do you understand? Oh, there they are. Right, let's see, he's looking, he's looking over there. Ah! Run! Woo! Woo! Do not test my patience. All right, how do I do this? Oh. 
Figure out what it is, guys. Ah, found you. I am taking Nora. You cannot stop me. Motherfucker. Go no near it, you dumb mother flubber. Walk near it. Walk near it. This is not your concern. It is between Boyle and me. Don't turn around. If this is how you want it to be, so be it. Focus, damn you! Does. What Boyle was doing to her? Got no choice. We fight or we die. I don't want to end up like this chump. Do you? Scanner, look everywhere. I am not leaving without my wife. Do you hear me? How you want it to be, so be it. He's given away his position. And Come on, come on. I destroyed one of them. Oh, more people. Awesome. It's gonna take me a while, I know it. There is no need for this, Batman. Look out! Just shortening the numbers. Three of them are right there. I won't allow my wife to be subjected to any more tests. Do you understand? Come on, get up. Of course, do you have any idea what Boyd was doing to her? Come on.
And now five arm. Eat the last thing. Gotta burn it. Let's see how well you do when the air freezes in your lungs. Uh -huh. I can Yeah, well. Well, Batman, come out and do what you came to do. Where are you? Strike! Search the area. This thing's kind you of old. You have forced me to do this. Hey, I found something. I think it belongs to him. Da, 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 da. Search the area. Focus, Daniel. Oh, snap. Come on, Mr. Freeze!
Where is Mr. Freeze going? Search the area. Well, Batman, come out and do what you feel about. You are resourceful, I'll give you that. I could be anywhere. How would it be escape? You have forced me to do this. Find him. He's spewing ice. I really trying real hard how to beat this guy. Alright, I really, really am sweating here. Hold on. Okay, I had some uh, a drink real quick. I'm ready to actually do some damage now. So. No, just uh... Search the area. 
Yeah, search the area. Yes, yes. Oh no, what did I do to deserve it? So I'm not fully upgraded. Oh, three, three bad guys left. Don't turn around. Where are you going? You want to stop me? Then come out of the shadows. Don't turn around. What's that? Nora, hang on. What did I sign up for? If I can get underneath him, I can take him from below. Command the bat. Cryogenic containment failing. Prime subject, Nora Freeze, in danger. Hang on, man. I've almost got you. going to have a problem explaining what happened in your lab. I mean, the police are never going to look at me after what you did. And with this bat freak dead, there won't be anyone left to say otherwise. Cryogenic containment failing. Yeah. And that just leaves you. Please, you can save me. You just have to bypass the fire. Victor! Steve. 
Breaking news out of North Gotham at this hour where protest has turned to celebration. Under extreme pressure from Gotham's citizens, Mayor Hill has just announced his resignation. While Hill has not ruled out a possible run for re-election in the new year, his resignation means that Peter Grogan will likely not be the next police commissioner of Gotham. Speculation has already begun about who the new mayor will appoint as commissioner, with many pundits naming GCPD Captain James Gordon as the frontrunner. And now to South Gotham, where Vicki Vale brings us this live report. Thanks, Janine. I'm standing at the corporate headquarters of Goth Corp, where Captain Gordon has confirmed that Goth Corp CEO Ferris Boyle has been taken into police custody. Police report that Mr. Boyle stands accused of manslaughter, extortion, and attempted murder. Shocking accusations given that just earlier tonight, he accepted the Wayne Foundation's award for Humanitarian of the Year. Also in custody is the notoriously elusive underworld crime boss Oswald Cobblepot, better known as the Penguin as well as a Gothcorp cryogenicist, Victor Freeze. Mr. Freeze is being held under heavy guard at Gotham General, receiving treatment for an undisclosed medical condition. Quincy Sharp has suggested that Mr. Freeze is yet another example of the type of criminal that needs the specialized care that only Arkham Asylum can provide. Police credit these arrests to solid police work, but this reporter suspects the vigilante known as the Batman had more than a small role to play. On a personal note, I owe Batman a debt of gratitude for rescuing me from almost certain death earlier this evening. So, thank you, Batman. For all of us. Back to you, Janine. Thanks, Vicky. The Batman continues to be one of the top stories this holiday season. So as we here at GNN wish you all a happy and safe New Year's Eve, we'll leave you with just a few of the comments you've made about Gotham's caped crusader. I was surrounded. Next thing you know, bam, boom, kapow! The bastards are all on the ground, KO'd. I didn't even see him coming. Oh, it was all a blur. He just whooshed in out of nowhere. Listen, I'm a cop. I can't condone what he does. But I can be grateful he's doing it. Oh, he's real, all right. I got the bruises to prove it. He's real, he's ruthless, and there ain't nothing in the world that's gonna stop him. Congratulations, sir. Victor, Ferris, and even that scoundrel Cobblepot are all in custody. Shall we call it a night, then? Not yet, Alfred. There's still work to be done. <laughs>